Fujikin Integrated Gas System is a compact and high-performance gas system featuring easy maintenance, realized in pursuit of ultra-clean technology required in the semiconductor manufacturing industry. Product features 1.125 W-seal IGS has realized downsizing about one quarter in footprint ratio as compared with the conventional gas systems. An IGS consists of a base block on a plate and top components and is designed based on the six basic concepts. We are now introducing the six IGS concepts. Higher engineering of basic technology and safety and clean technology. The IGS uses the safety and clean technology and is therefore oil free through precision cleaning and external leak free by adoption of the WSEAL method and welding technology. Integration of gas system makes dead space free, particle free and outgas free by advanced surface treatment technology and UP treatment of gas wetted components and corrosion free by use of ultra low manganese material in a weld. Downsizing we started gradual downsizing from the previously developed and manufactured 1.5 W-seal type IGS and the most recent model, a 1 W-seal IGS, is 10 millimeters in width, about one quarter of the 1.5 W-seal width. Improvement in reliability, isolating the sealing faces from components receiving external stress. IGS has a strong structure against external stresses it is not the external surface of the seal, but the entire body surface that receives the stress. Therefore, the seal is not affected whatsoever. Step 1. When the top component starts to be tightened with silver-plated cap screws, the gasket is deformed and sealed at the seal tip. Step 2. Subsequently, the gasket is further deformed and sealed on the inside contact surface. Step 3. Further tightening allows the outside of the seal tip to be in close contact with the gasket surface. Step 4. At the end of tightening, the body is completely in close contact with the gasket. Leveling System IGS adopts a leveling system. Tightening the silver-plated cap screws of the top component will horizontally lift the base block, thus providing a structure that makes it difficult for metal plate flatness to affect sealing performance. Step 1. Tightening fasteners of the base block allows the base block and the sleeve edge to closely contact the plate. Step 2. Tightening fasteners of the top component will lift the base block, leveling the top component in a horizontal position. The base block is lifted, however, seal performance is not affected because the sleeves are in close contact with the mounting plate, irrespective of its flatness. Improvement in workability and maintenance, fastener capture system. The top component has a fastener capture system. Fasteners will not come off from the top component. Silver-plated cap screws. By silver plating bolts that fix IGS's upper components, high durability has been realized. Further, in consideration of corrosion resistance, SUS XM7 is adopted. Gasket with a guide ring. IGS adopts a guide ring fitted gasket, therefore simply fitting a gasket makes alignment possible. And even when the gasket drops on the ground, for example, the guide ring will first contact the ground without the gasket surface being contacted, thus providing a structure that makes it difficult for foreign matter to attach on the seal surface. Undirectional access to components for assembly and removal. Since IGS is designed to allow assembly and removal of all parts from above, 
an individual component can be removed for replacement without interfering with other devices. Leak Detection Port Top components are equipped with a leak detection port for each seal part, allowing leak detection with pinpoint accuracy. Tape Heaters Being flat on both sides, IGS can be heated with tape heaters simply sandwiching the sides. Dedicated Toolkit Dedicated tools are supplied with an IGS for quick and reliable assembly and removal work. Promotion of standardization. Fujikin IGS has specified seal-to-seal -seal dimensions and sizes in the interface specifications of the semi-standard. Various layout designs can be flexibly configured by combination. Adopting Fujikin IGS shortens the lead time for each process, leading to a total cost reduction. IGS Assembly Procedures for 1.125 W-Seal IGS Assemble base blocks on the plate Using fasteners to temporarily set the base blocks and the plate in position Then align the base blocks in the correct position using a pitch gauge With a pitch gauge for each base block being set in position, finally tighten fasteners using a torque driver. After this is done, remove the pitch gauges to complete the base block assembly procedures. Assemble silver plated cap screws on the top component. The mounting hole has an O-ring inside which holds a fastener and prevents it coming off. Therefore, insert fastener while slowly rotating them into the hole. Forcing to insert it may damage the O-ring. Attach a gasket to the top component. Always use a new gasket and set it on top of the component using gasket tweezers. Using silver plated cap screws, lightly assemble the top component on the base block. Tighten these screws using a hex wrench while taking care not to allow uneven tightening. The sealing ports are sealed with two pairs of fasteners, A and B and C and D. Uniformly tighten each pair of fasteners using a hex wrench to ensure that the base block and the top component are in parallel with each other. Turn fastener A by about 60 degrees using a torque driver. Likewise, turn fastener B by about 60 degrees. Turn fastener A until the torque driver spins idle. Repeat this procedure on fastener B, too. Tighten fasteners C and D just in the same way as done for fastener A and B. To complete the entire procedures, Precautions for assembling an IGS When you set a gasket, please use gasket tweezers. Please do not pick up and set the gasket by hand. To fully tighten the fasteners, be sure to use a torque driver controlled to be at the specified tightening torque. All IGS components are precision devices requiring utmost care in handling. Rebuild work for IGS 1.125 W seal. Using a hex wrench, loosen the silver-plated cap screws located on the left side of the top component. 
When removing the fasteners, take care not to have the top component fall. Remove the top component and detach the used gaskets using gasket tweezers. Be sure to use a brand new gasket for the top component to be newly assembled. Do not reuse used gaskets to avoid possible leaks. Fit a new top component in accordance with the same procedures as used for assembly.